Hi, good evening. I am Palm Praise 2, and I like to welcome you to an evening edition read here on Palm Praise 2. Certainly, uh, peace and blessings be upon you and your family this evening. Now, for this evening read, what I have for you is a message to the black man. I have a message to the black man. Now, for this message to the black man is by Elijah Muhammad. Currently, right now, we are in the section entitled, We Must Teach Our Own. So, without further ado, this read that I have for you, it reads as such. Uh, today, with all of our white civilized schooling, we have not been taught of our own. They will teach us of our own. Since the coming of Allah, their reason for not teaching us of our own is made crystal clear. The knowledge that Allah has given us gives us not gives us gives the knowledge of our own. Let me repeat that sentence. The knowledge that Allah has given us gives the knowledge of our own. Being the first people of the earth, we are destined to be the last. We are the creators and the makers. This limited civilization of the white man and his rule is now terminated, never to be brought into existence again. This makes it absolutely against the will of the white man to honor and respect you and me and our nation as being the first people and makers of the universe. Why so much teaching and warning given to the American so-called Negro and so little or no teaching of the kind being given to the African and Asian black nation. Hmm. It is due to the fact that we are living in the midst of a people whom Allah God will destroy in the very near future. We are on the brink of fire and must be removed to a zone of safety. The ignoring of such warnings and of the time of the judgment of this world, the Caucasian world, with their great universal power that they have exercised over the black nation, makes it very hard for the average black person to conceive of the idea of such a strong race of people being removed. This is a very small thing in the eyes and power of Allah. Removing and destroying people who have brought his anger against them for their neglect of worship and respect of him as the supreme being who do not even respect his representatives but prosecute and kill them. These people have been the worst people to us, the black nation, since they have been on the face of the earth. They were created and made for just the purpose of destroying our peace as well as our lives. They have destroyed 600 million of the black nation since they have been on our planet. 
This averages 100 million every thousand years of their rule. They have affected nine tenths of the total population of the black man under their rule, including the brown, red, and yellow races. They have deceased. They have, excuse me, deceived as the Bible, in parentheses, Revelation of John says the whole world, and now they are being made manifest as the deceivers and adversaries of Allah and his true religion of entire submission to his will, in parentheses, Islam. This black people of America who have been swallowed symbolically by the white slave masters and his children must now be brought out of this race of people and be taught the knowledge of their own. Allah is holding the affair in person under the name of Master Farad Muhammad. He has chosen us today to be his people and mean to take us and build and establish forever a people of righteousness and a people with unlimited knowledge of the divine, supreme being. The very last of one of these will become greater than the greatest of this world. The Orthodox Muslims will have to bow to the choice of Allah. Allah will bring about a new Islam. As for the principles of belief, they remain the same. There will be no signs to be watched for the coming of God and the setting up of a new world of Islam. We are seeing this change now and entering into it. The devils oppose this change. And the Orthodox joined them in opposing us because of their desire to carry on the old way of Islam. Allah will place those of his choice and authority in the making of the new world. And others must obey whomever he puts in authority or find themselves fighting against the power of whomever they hold to be on their side and in their favor. We must have a new world. We accept for a new nation completely. As Yaqub brought about a people, the present white race, whom were a completely new people made out of the original of us, Another new people must be made to be the ruling voice of tomorrow out of this old world that is now living her last days. They will be completely new people. The Holy Quran and Bible refer to them as being brought about by the power and will of God in person in the resurrection of the mentally dead, lost, found, original people in America. We may not seem to please you or to be pleasing to Allah, but it is written in the Bible that he will give to whom he pleases and chastise whom he pleases. This is to warn us that we have no choice in the matter. Whatever Allah desires, he will bring into being, whether we like it or not. That does complete our section here on Poem Praise 2. We must teach our own. So at this time, I certainly would like for you to hit the like button, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell. You'll know when I, Poem Praise 2, is coming with something new for you. I certainly do want for you and your family to be blessed, to be well, 
to be safe and it be at thy will. I'll talk with you soon. So until then, later, 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 y'all. All right. I'll see you soon. Till next time.